Welcome back in, everybody. There is no hiding that Bill Fenley's Cyclones had their share of struggles last season. You can call it a down year, absolutely. But you know what's great about that is that there's almost always resurgence on the way, and that could be this year. Like every other basketball coach that you're going to talk to this time of year, everyone's excited, everyone's optimistic. Bill Fenley has very good reason to feel good about this season. Learning what that next group is, like who comes off the bench, when they come off the bench, who they come off the bench with, might be more important for us this year than it's ever been because we've never had a bench. The Cyclones added seven newcomers to the roster this year, and each has the potential to contribute on the court. We're 14 players. Hasn't been that since I was here. Um, so that's also different. You know, you get in, you play hard, and then you come out, and then you wait for your next sub. Last year, I think we had like 10 players, and there was people hurt every day at practice. So there's a lot of people in the gym, a lot of players with jersey on that get rotated in. Finley has yet to name his starting five, but we can expect to see the usual suspects. That includes first team All Big 12 guard Bridget Carlton. But that last spot is up for grabs, and it's breeding good competition. Everybody's fighting for that uh, starting five spot, but at the same time, we all just want everybody to do good. Every time I'm in the gym, it's an opportunity to show them how, how hard you have to work to be successful at this level. Um, you know, I want to share my knowledge of the game with them um, and to kind of teach them what it, what it means to play at this level. If you watch this practice today, there'd be 12 people in a competitive situation, and life's about competition. So we're going to see who competes and who wants to play. Season still just a month away. Iowa State will host Southwest Baptist for an exhibition game on November 1st. The Clones will also play a new women's NIT the week after that.